No, Dev can just show you how to install VPS Office on Ubuntu 70.4. Let's go. Get it now. If you have a 32 bit system, choose this folder. If you have a 64 bit system, choose this folder. Let me choose this one. You will find this link in the description of the video. Right. Yes, so don't worry about writing it down. And let's open up this folder, this text folder now, text file. As you can see, here's some guidelines. So next, we're going to install GDAP. GDAP is a very nice tool to install dev packages on the printer. So let's go. I'm going to open up a terminal by pressing Ctrl Alt and T together. I'm going to move it to the dash side. And I'm going to simply copy this line and paste it into the terminal. Let's enter the password and say OY and enter. And this will install GDB. I'm going to fast forward this part. Just to make it a bit quicker, the video. Wonderful. While the installation is finishing up, if you have tried to install VPS Office and you get an error that you need this package, which happens in the Bluetooth 17.4 and 16.10, it's very easy to fix. So let's copy this line into our browser. Any problems. I'm going to close the terminal quickly. We finish with it. And I'm going to just paste it in here. And we hope it works. <laughs> and now you have to choose between your 30, 62 bit system or your 32 bit system. 64 bit, I'm going to click on this and you can click on any one of these links. Click on this one and I'm going to say save file. Okay, this is a very small file, it's already downloaded. I'm going to open up, please. Come here and I'm going to say Open with other software because we installed GDB and I prefer it. It's giving me less trouble than the other ones. Now we just wait. And say so install package. Type a password. You need to wait. This is all for the preparation of installing VPS. As you can see, it's already finished installed. So it's very quick. So we can close here, close here, and wait for the download to be finished. And once again, I'm going to fast forward this. Wonderful, as we are finishing up now, we can get ready to install VPS Office. Soon, 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 yay! Let's open this folder. As we can see, we got VPS now. And open with other installation. You can of course drive, drive the default and not install DDP. I just prefer DDP. Select and as usual, we just wait for VDP to open up and ask for a password.
Um, let's install packets. After which you can delete all the stuff, no problem. Drop the password. And let's see if it will install. Open your closer browser now. And let's see the action. I'm gonna click this box and I'm gonna fast forward this part. Wonderful, it's finished and it seems to be successful. So let's close everything up. Fast forward. If it does the same to you. And we can delete everything here if you want to. And go to the search and voila, VPS office is installed. Let's see if it will open up. I agree. Yes, thank you for watching.